Thank you, Celine, for providing the overview information. I would like to show you the latest status from the NMPA. In August 2019, the NMPA announced the pilot work plan of UDI system with order number 56. Subsequently, order number 66 about the regulations for the UDI system was released. The pilot phase of the UDI database was extended to the end of December 2020. As you probably already noticed, the test phase of the UDI system has already been completed in China. A UDI test system and a productive system are available now. On this slide you see the website of NMPA. Here you can find the news regulations of China about the drugs and medical devices. If you are interested in UDI information, you can click on the link Medical Devices. You can use our Excel template for uploading data to UDI China database. This Excel template has several sheets. We apply cell color to the UDI China attributes and on the sheet README, the color codes are explained. For instance, green for key field, yellow for drop-down list, and pink for checkbox and so on. On the sheet UDI field explanation, the technical information of the data attributes are listed. Name, description, technical property fields, for instance, obligatory field, yes, no, data type, field length, visibility, and so on. It is also helpful that, for many attributes, there are some input samples available. On the third sheet, UDI attributes, you can input your UDI data line by line. These data will be later submitted to the NMPA. The other worksheets are used to provide code list in dropdown to help you filling out the form. For instance, on the sheet CL Carrier are code lists for carriers. This slide shows our data connection to the UDI China database. The data exchange format is JSON. If you've never heard about JSON, it is just a readable format for structuring data, similar to XML, but smaller, faster, and easier to read.